how an Amazon package gets from the factory to your doorstep. All Amazon deliveries do not follow this identical path, and warehouse operations differ. This particular route was developed using information from Amazon's website, discussions with supply chain and warehouse staff, and statistics from those sources. For customers, two-day delivery actually involves a significantly longer process because packages frequently travel across continents and pass through numerous hands. In Jiaxing, Zhejiang, a northern Chinese province, the company's factory produces the renowned Orlay coat. At the manufacturer, the coat is examined, packaged, and labeled. A pallet that will be placed into a shipping container is loaded with the packaged coat. Amazon can purchase space on a shipping container through a freight forwarder, but not all of its products are shipped in containers with the Amazon logo. Trucks, trains, or barges are used to transport the products out of the factory. Longshoremen deliver the shipping container to the port, where it is later loaded onto a cargo ship. The container is loaded onto the ship at its specified location by a crane operator who picks it up from hundreds of feet in the air. When the ship is completely loaded, it departs. The ship might make numerous port stops on route or travel directly to well-known locations like the ports of Los Angeles and Long Beach. A ship can cruise from Southern California to major ports in China in up to 20 days. While keeping watch and maintaining the ship's equipment, the crew tends to the ship's daily demands. Sometimes the ships have to wait for a dock space to open up until they arrive at their destination. Cargo ships can wait up to two months to dock and unload at the biggest ports in the US. Then, some Amazon items are placed into ships that Amazon has hired. These ships can avoid Southern California port delays by sailing instead to smaller ports like the Port of Houston and the Port of Everett in Washington State because they are normally smaller. When the port is prepared to receive the ship, a local harbor pilot carefully pilots the crew and tugboats attached to the side of the ship into the port. The ship's deck is hung with enormous cranes that unload the containers. The shipping container is subsequently transported to a port terminal. On the basis of its destination and planned pickup, everything is properly stacked there. The cargo containers at Southern Californian ports may have to wait weeks for a truck to come pick them up. The container is taken from the trucker's pickup location to a warehouse or shipping yard. When the trucks arrive at an Amazon Fulfillment Center's inbound loading dock, dock employees unload the items. The products are subsequently placed on pallets by associates. Pallets of items are transported to the stowers via freight elevator by workers known as water spiders. At the stowing station, a tower analyzes each box individually, including your coat. It is subsequently given a cubby within a robotic pod. Inside Amazon warehouses, thousands of pods, each housing dozens of goods, may be found. Until it is ordered online, your coat is kept in a pod. The robot will autonomously roll the appropriate pod to a picking station after the coat has been ordered. The coat is removed from the pod by a picker, who then places it in a yellow crate and places it on a conveyor belt. The coat moves along a conveyor belt through the warehouse before arriving at a packing station. The size of the box to utilize in this situation is dictated by a computer. The packer then seals the package with tape and labels it with an order barcode. The packer then repositions the box onto the conveyor belt, where it makes its way to the outbound docks, its final stop. A slam device weighs the shipment along the way and affixes a shipping label to the box. Scan, label, apply, and manifest is the acronym for SLAM. Your code is sorted onto a conveyor belt that links to the waiting delivery vehicles as it arrives at the outbound port. From Amazon's fulfillment center, the truck moves the jacket to a sortation facility, where the parcels are further organized by location and delivery time. The coat could be transported via an Amazon airplane or carrier vehicle after being loaded at the sortation facility. Eventually, the coat travels the last mile of delivery to your door. Delivery Service Partners DSP, are hired by Amazon to travel thousands of last mile routes across the nation. The Orly coat is then delivered to the customer's door.